Have you seen this video of a pastor preaching to his congregation? I'm sure there's a lot of Africans that were brought over into slavery, which wasn't right, but they got the gospel when they got here. You know, what would be better for them to have lived their entire life in Africa free, doing their voodoo or whatever, or what happened? First of all, your gospel is clearly not my gospel. The gospel I know is good news to the oppressed, not a good excuse for oppression. But second and very important, Christianity already existed in West and Central Africa well before white enslavers stole my ancestors. In fact, historians found a letter written in the year 1619, where a Catholic bishop was outraged that more than 4,000 African Christians had been captured by slave traders in Angola. This means that it is likely that there were Christians among the very first Africans sold on on American soil. Thing three, at some point Christians have to ask themselves, what is it about their faith that allows it to so easily fit within the framework of white supremacy? So no, we didn't need your bastardized version of Christianity then, and we certainly don't need it now. If you enjoy content about history and culture, subscribe.